India has the highest number of child sex abuse cases. Have we asked ourselves why is that so? I think it is because we choose to be silent about the issue and we choose not to talk about it and we are giving an indirect message to the perpetrator that it is okay to abuse a child and you can go scot free. So I think it is time that we as a society come together and first make ourselves aware about child sex abuse and then empower and educate our children to do the same. And how can we do it? By teaching them the difference between the safe and the unsafe touch, by giving them age appropriate knowledge about their body parts etc and telling them that it is okay to say no if a perpetrator is trying to force himself or herself on you. And please remember that uh, any child of any age under the age of 17 is at risk of being sexually abused, be it a boy or a girl, uh, be, be it the person might be staying in a slum or in a mansion, uh, it could be anywhere, any state, any socio-economic class, the child is at equal risk. And that is because uh, the perpetrator is everywhere, there is no defined pattern of a perpetrator and you cannot identify them. Uh, in most cases, it is people who are known to the child because then the child is easily accessible to them. So it could be the next door auntie or it could be a family friend, it could be a grandfather, it could be a parent for that matter, it could be the school peon. So net net, I think we need to come out of this uh, whole mode, the, uh, denial mode that our kid is safe and nothing can happen to my child. Child sex abuse can happen to any child of any age, of any socio-economic class and anywhere. So let's educate ourselves and let's break these myths and take the pledge to protect our children to give them a better future. Thank you.